What's up guys, Pop 101 here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to download XPS models into Blender and export them as well. This includes XPS, ASCII, and mesh files as well. So let's get started. I have included a link to this website below, but all you really need to do is scroll down, click on this link, scroll down again, I'd recommend clicking on the Dropbox link, go to 2.80, and download XNA Lara Mesh 2.0.2. Click on it, direct download. It downloads right there, easy. After you've done that, what you want to do is type in Blender 2.8 download. Click on it. Now you want to download Blender. Previous versions. All previous versions. Scroll down. Go to 2.8 and choose whatever version you have. Now I downloaded this one, but you guys might be downloading a different version. It just depends on what system you're running. Anyways, download that. Now you go to your file explorer. And you go to wherever you saved your blender. I saved it in the D drive. So you go to it, scroll down, and you double click on the blender application. After you open it up, this is what you'll see. A nice cube in the middle. So you want to go to edit, preferences. You click on add-ons, it will start you in the interface, I believe. But you go to add-ons, install, I saved mine to the desktop. You want to download the zip, not the open folder, but the zip. Click on it. You install the add on from file. And since I already had it, there's already one installed. But all you do is make sure to check it. It will now work. So after doing that, you will go to file, import, and now you can import and export. ASCII, Mesh, and XPS models. Just so you can see it on both. There you go. To actually import and export a model, what you want to do is, let's first delete our cube so it's not in our project. You go to Import, XNA Lara, XPS, click on it. Now for you guys, I'd recommend saving to the desktop. And since I want to do Naruto stage dash valley at the end, click on that. And now this is my dot mesh file, which I want to actually upload. So we import it. And there we have it. This is our model. Now to actually export this model, what you want to do is go to file, export. Let's say you want to export it as an FBX. You click on active collection right here or selected objects depending on what you want to do but I'd recommend active selection because it exports everything now you can simply just type it in as whatever you want so like that you name it export FBX now to actually check to see if we have it we can go to our desktop scroll down and there we have it. Now there hasn't been any real documentation or any good documentation on this process, but hopefully this helps any of you that are trying to do it. So with that, thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It helps out the channel a ton and I'd greatly appreciate it. There is a link below if you'd like to learn how to mod for Blade and Sorcery or just hang out with the community in general. Have a good time. If you'd like to support the channel and myself, there is also a link down below to my Patreon and my brand new merch store, so you better get your stuff before it sells out. But with that, thank you for watching.